This is the worst idea you've ever had. We can't go marching onto Stag's aircraft carrier. Why not? I'll look just like Cyrus. All I gotta add is a fucked attitude. What happens when you're on board? I walk in with my prisoners, they take me to the cell block, I grab Shondi and we leave. <laughs> I'm sorry, prisoners? Yeah, you and Pierce. <laughs> I'm bringing you in. Oh, hell no! Showtime. We need one of them stag transport to get to that carrier. This is weirding me out. Okay, so we get to the carrier. What then? I escort you two prisoners to the brig. We find Sean D, then we escape. What if they just shoot us? Stop bringing logic into this. <laughs> what do you think? I look the part? Considering I want to stab your ass right now? Yeah, I'd say it works. Mind your manner. I am your superior officer. I should slap that face right off you. You want to swim back? <sighs> this isn't giving me any confidence. You sure you got his face right? You know how often this guy gets on camera? I'm just saying. I'm sure, all right? That's all I wanted. You know, this is a good look for you. You should keep the face when you're done with it. Are you serious? Cyrus is very powerful and statuesque. You complained about a costume, and now you want the boss to run around with Cyrus's face? It was just a suggestion. Don't get all bent out of shape. On, we're nearly there. This is a horrible idea. Just do it already. Look, you may be cool with wearing handcuffs, but this motherfucker ain't down with that. What's that supposed to mean? Well, you know, you ran a prostitution ring. So clearly I'm into kink. You carry a gun. Does that mean you like to be shot? No. So how about we stop being a judgmental man child? Okay. Prisoner. Quiet. Welcome back, sir. What's up? Uh, I need you to sign off on some prototypes I've been working on. Thanks for the offer, uh, you. But I want to process these two ASAP. I can take these two down to detention for you, sir. Thanks. What the fuck, man? <clears throat> Don't you look at the commander. This way, sir. Lead on! So, how do you like Steelport? It's disgusting. My area. I'm more of a Stillwater bloke myself. Bloke? 
Oh, I picked up that when I was stationed in Britain. Sir, I'm familiar with your jacket. You were never stationed in the UK. Sure I wasn't. Oh. I probably said too much. Uh, let's not talk about this ever again. I, under I understand, sir. Sir, R&D has sent a prototype for a new vehicle. A jet-propelled cycle. You shitting me? Sir? Oh, I mean, uh, it's not like that shit they usually give me, is it? No, sir. It is top quality. But also they cooked up. They have some improvements to our tank's weaponry. Should pack more firepower. Splendid, splendid, splendid. And there's also portable satchel charges for the troops. Once we get to R&D, I'll need you to sign off on two projects. Looking forward to it. That's your name. It's me, Pierce, Viola, and I came to get you out. Oh, thank God it's you. We gotta get you home. You look like shit. Boss? We have to find a way off this About thing. Time. We could blow it up first. Break mine. Where to? Reactor control room. 
Heard the guards talking about how dangerous it was. something in that control area keeping this place running. Take it out and the ship should blow. You sure? Fuck no! I'm just working on movies here. Is going in the book. We might have overdone it. Now we can focus on Kilbane. What about Stag? We just blew up an aircraft carrier. What else could they throw at us? Martial law, didn't you? I knew the Saints. How did Mayor Reynolds react? He'll fall in line. They all will. Keep me updated, Commander. Of course, ma'am. Sir, the commandos are en route. We'll have the whole city locked down in 72 hours. Outstanding. Thank you, Kia. Permission to speak freely? It's about damn time we took off the kid gloves. Two little words, Kia. Shock and awe. 